Ah, the cold, empty void between stars. Nothing to breathe, nothing to touch, nothing to mess up your hair. Welcome to deep space. I'll be your host, a disembodied voice who's smart enough to stay off the planets we're about to visit. Strap in or don't. It's zero gravity. We're starting from the edge. First stop, Pluto. The planet that got demoted faster than your high school band's drummer. It's freezing, it's lonely, and it takes 248 years to orbit the sun. You'll survive here for about three seconds, less if you're a drama queen. Neptune, big, blue, and beautiful. But don't let the color fool you. This is a hypersonic wine tunnel of death. Winds up to well on 200 miles per hour. If the cold doesn't kill you, the planet's temper definitely will. Next up, Uranus. Yes, yes, get your jokes out now, but this ice giant is no laughing matter. Tilted on its side like it passed out at a party, Uranus spins horizontally. It smells like rotten eggs, and its atmosphere is made of methane, so every breath would be your last and your worst. Temperature? A cool 224 degrees C. That's colder than your ex's texts. And if you're wondering how long you'd survive here, 0.75 seconds. Unless you count turning into an ice sculpture as surviving. Ah, Saturn. The fashion icon of the solar system. Those rings, made of ice, rock, and moon fragments. Basically cosmic glitter. But as pretty as it looks, Saturn has no surface to land on. You'll just keep falling forever, screaming stylishly. The winds? 100 miles per hour. The pressure? Enough to turn you into a human jelly bean. You'd last about 1.5 seconds here. Long enough to say, wow, that's pr- Splat. Jupiter. The angry king of the solar system. Twice as massive as all the other planets combined, it's basically a cosmic bouncer. Home to the Great Red Spot, a 300-year-old storm bigger than Earth. Because apparently, overkill is a theme here. Fall in and you'll be squashed by atmospheric pressure long before you see the core. Survival time? Let's be generous and say 0.1 seconds if you dive in head first. Bring a helmet or don't. It won't help. Mars, everyone's favorite backup planet. The red dust ball with more ambition than atmosphere. Surface temperature swings from a warmish 20 degree to 125 degree faster than your mood after checking your bank balance. Atmosphere, thin, mostly carbon dioxide. Air pressure, a joke. You'd survive for about 60 seconds if you held your breath, assuming you didn't panic and explode your lungs first. But hey, at least the sunsets are pretty. And now, Earth. Blue, breathable, slightly on fire. But it's the only place where you can walk around without instantly dying, unless you're in rush hour traffic or Twitter. We've got oceans, trees, and a breathable atmosphere. It's not perfect, but it's home. So maybe let's stop trying to terraform Mars and start unterraforming Earth. Just a thought. Venus, the hottest planet in the solar system and not in a good way. Surface temp, 475 degrees sex. That's hot enough to melt lead or your hopes and dreams. The pressure is 92 times that of Earth. It's like being 900 meters underwater while breathing acid. Survival time? Less than one second. Your spacecraft would melt faster than an ice cream on a volcano. Mercury. The tiny metal marble closest to the sun. No atmosphere, no mercy. During the day, it hits 430 deg C. At night, 180 deg C. Great place to roast and freeze at the same time. And finally, the sun. 1.4 million kilometers wide, mostly angry hydrogen. Want to visit the surface? No, you don't. You'd vaporize halfway there, but at least you'd go out in style as a puff of dramatic solar plasma. Like, comment, and subscribe for more fun adventures.